Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Come learn and grow with me. So today I actually have some inspirational quotes for you. Um, and I'm going to read a few of my affirmators cards because those are always amazing to add to anything. Um, and I figured I would do like one video of inspirational quotes every week. Um, just because inspiration is always needed in everyone's life, and I feel like the world really needs more inspiration. Um, so I picked out a few of these cards um, that just happened to fall out. I shuffled them and these fell out. So these are the ones I feel like are from the universe that we all need to hear right now. And if you're attracted to this video, then these quotes are for you as well, because you wouldn't have been attracted if there wasn't a message in here for you. So thank you all so much for tuning in. And here we go. Courage is the first one. Have courage. No one is fearless. No one. But even though I'm not fearless, I am courageous. When fear shows up, I don't run away from it. I use my courage to conquer it. My courage allows me to walk right up to that fear and kick it in the nuts, then quickly hide behind someone bigger until it goes away. <laughs> Which is super cute. And self-love, because that's always important. I openly embrace a feeling of self-love, the PG kind. I love myself because I understand myself. I love myself as the most committed partner I will ever have. I show myself love any way that I can, and when I screw up, I remember to be sweet and gentle with myself. If not, I'm going to make myself sleep on the couch. Got that, self? Inspiration. There is a voice of inspiration within me. Right now, it's only a whisper. But the more I listen, the louder it will get. Soon, it will be a flawless speech voiced by Earl James Earl Jones through a megaphone with lots of applause. Yay, me! <laughs> Perseverance, which is always important. It seems you're on a massive journey right now, and this card has arrived to remind you that you will reach the other side. The mountain you're climbing is a huge and formidable, but so is your ability to climb it. You don't need to enjoy it. You just need to tackle it. Complain if it makes the job easier. Blow off steam. You think mountain climbers get to the top of Mount Everest on inspirational quotes? No way. They're grunting and crying and cursing like freaking pirates. That just doesn't sell a lot of posters. <laughs> that was a cute one. Personal growth. As I move toward greater consciousness, I feel old thoughts and habits fall away. Like training wheels on a bike. They helped me get to where I am, but now that I can ride, I don't need those slow and crummy wheels, except when I'm making big bike analogies. <laughs> Everyone's a teacher. Everyone I cross paths with is a teacher in that moment. The ones who give me the fun lessons are the ones I call friends. The ones who give me the hard lessons I sometimes call a-holes. They've chosen a tough job, but someone's got to do it. So today, I'm thanking all the a-holes. Thank you, a-holes, for playing your part in making me a better person. So thank you, a-holes. You guys rock. Impermanence. Thankfully. Life is always changing, and I drift easily through these those changes, good and bad. As I drift through hard times, I can take comfort in knowing that I will leave them behind. As I drift away from good times, I can take comfort in knowing that more will come my way. Impermanence is an equal opportunity, non-entity. Super amazing, right? And those are the Affirmator cards. And now I'm going to read you a couple quotes out of some amazing books because I love books and they teach me, they have taught me so much and I love to share amazing quotes out of them. Um, so this one's Bridge Between Worlds by Dan Millman and Doug Childers. And the quote I have for you is, Mindfulness teaches us the nature of the shadow. Heartfulness teaches us the nature of the light. Without these two qualities in balance, we will evolve either eyeless in the darkness or blinded by the light. And that quote is by Stephen and Andrea Levine. And it's a super amazing quote. 
And I also have an author quote by Albert Einstein, because he's one of my favorite people of history. Your imagination is your preview of life's common attractions by Albert Einstein. And I have a couple more quotes for you out of this book called Be Happy, 170 Ways to Transform Your Day by Patrick Lindsay. The first one I have is Break the Cycle. When you're in a rut, first recognize the cycle in which you're trapped. Then consider ways to break out of it. Most of our restrictions are imaginary. Many disappear simply by viewing things differently. Only others need a different plan, but when you put your mind to it, there's always a plan. The attempt and not the deed come confounds us by William Shakespeare. And another one I have for you is Deliver. So often we bail out before finishing a task. We'll always find excuses to justify it. But when, but then we live in the shadow of unfulfilled promises. Whenever you can, move out of these shadows. No matter how long it takes, whether big or small, finish the job. You'll be amazed at the freedom it brings. Give us the tools and we will finish the job. By Sir Winston Churchill. And another one I have for you is Unleash Your Imagination. Our mind's powers are virtually unlimited and largely untapped. With imagination, we can create new worlds and improve old ones, live our wildest dreams, and dream our wildest lives. Imagination has neither rules nor boundaries. Dreams are the language of creation. And that quote is by Bernie Siegel. Manage your time. It's one of our most precious assets. Most precious, for sure. And we don't know how much time, and we don't know how much of it we have. Value is highly devoted to the most important things. Your family, your loved ones, your friends. Then apportion it to your career. Not the other way around. The best and most beautiful things in the world cannot be seen or even touched. They must be felt with the heart. And that quote is by Helen Keller. Move to the edge. We set our boundaries for safety or from fear or because of habit. Test them. See why you drew them. Push against them. Break through them. Find your edge. Feel the exhilaration. For what is freedom but the unfettered use of all the powers which God for use has given? And that quote is by Samuel Taylor Coleridge. And one last one I have for you is share wisdom. It's rewarding. It brings benefits to both giver and receiver. Pass on your hard-won experience, especially where it can stop suffering or pain. Hand on knowledge generously. It will be repaid tenfold. If you have, give. If you learn, teach. And that quote is by Maya Angelou. So definitely do that. Teach. Share your wisdom. Share your amazing stories with people. Because stories are amazing. Especially when it has an awesome lesson at the end. Like when you learn your lessons, share them with other people about how you learned the lessons out of your life. Because so many times we can help people in those ways. And it's so important to share our knowledge and share amazing things with people to make day people's lives brighter and better and make them smile more. So with that being said, smile more. Um, love, light, and blessings to you all always. Thank you all so, so much for tuning in and watching. I wish you all a wonderful, beautiful day filled with so many blessings and so much joy in everything you love. So with that being said, peace.